So to get a good night's sleep, it's really important to breathe through the nose. And I know it's not often mentioned in terms of sleep hygiene, but it's probably the number one thing that we should be doing. It's not just about breathing through the nose during sleep, but it's also about breathing through the nose during the day. That's not my idea. The top sleep doctor in the world, Dr. Christian Guimano, he was talking about this for the last five to six years of his life, and he passed away in 2019. And he spoke about the critical importance of restoring nasal breathing, both during wakefulness and sleep. About 50% of the adult population sleep with their mouth open and probably similar enough for children. We should never wake up with a dry mouth in the morning. If we wake up with a dry mouth, it signifies that we are very likely to be mouth breathing during sleep. So one simple tool that we've been using for over 20 years is taping the mouth. Now the tape isn't as bad as it seems. This tape here is my O tape. And it's specifically designed to surround the mouth and bring the lips together. So if there was an emergency, one can open the mouth. So what I would like you to do is to demonstrate it. So you're taking off a strip of tape. And you stretch it about 40% or so. And the objective is that you're stretching at about 40% and covering and surrounding the, the mouth. And then you're just gently pressing it against the skin. Now, because the tape is elasticated, it's creating a tension to bring your lips together. And also from talking with physiotherapists and physical therapists, it's helping to stimulate the orbicularis oris muscle, which can help to improve tone. So it's a very simple tool, and we would always say to people, wear tape around the lips for about three months or so. This way we start changing the habit of mouth breathing during sleep. It's not just about getting the mouth closed during sleep, of course, it's also about improving our breathing patterns. So some people might think, well, all I have to do is tape up. Well, if you have a congested nose, you need to know the tools to decongest the nose. If you have breathing pattern disorder, it's very important that you address that. Getting the mouth closed is one factor, but also practicing different breathing exercises to improve breathing patterns is vital. So that is my O-tape.